So this is a good thing to show right here, spatial sounds. So if you go in close, it's louder. If you back away, it's softer. If you, if you turn left, it comes in on the right. And if you turn the other way, it comes in your other ear. And if you turn around, Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Motion Part 27, Refactor and Extend. Today, we re-entered with something we had done since last time. We set up a virtual environment brainstorm room with playable music, including returning and Part 1. So you just heard Part 1 playing there. Did we? Yes, you did, because if you may recall, Part 1 sounds like... Sounds like this. No, that was actually part. Yeah, that's it. So what we did in our, this is a new virtual environment you haven't seen yet, is we, uh, we put these little spheres here. I know it's hard to see there, these little spheres. And um, we actually showed the room during the stream. So that was kind of cool. So this is another way our perspective of music and animation are extending in this series. Music and animation can support mental introspection expressed in brainstorming, writing, and drawing. And that's what the purpose of that room is for. And again, music and animation can be thought of as accompanists or as the stars themselves. So we did that. Now, we also went into our uh, part two, and we you may or may not remember that this used to be in, uh, well, I'll show it to you. It used to be in a, in a, a wild kind of changing notation. It had... You know, a quarter note equals 60, and it was 2-4 time, and then all of a sudden we jumped to a quarter note equals 480, and it sounded cool and all that. However, it was very hard to work with to extend and uh, deepen the music. So what we did is we refactored it. We converted it to 6-8 time and uh, quarter equals 120. And we did that using some tricks about copy-paste that we learned in the previous composition in returning, as a matter of fact. So the definition of refactoring is the music sounds the same. This is what it sounded like in this kind of profile. And now this is what it sounds like. So we did add a few other parts, but... So you can hear we already added some bass, but in refactoring it, we learned a couple new tricks about refactoring. We learned that, well, we confirmed refactoring of itself does not change how it sounds. It makes it easier to extend and develop. At the same time, the original way we wrote this piece, this part two, gave us a lot of room to do some really f funky shifts and timing and syncopations between how the parts handed off to each other. So when we went into the, you know, the more official point of view, we were having to put, you know, partial measures here and there all over the place to make it still sound the same. Uh, and it, it worked. It works great. So we almost, this is almost like composing by serendipity over here. And then we just carefully bring it back to the refactored version. We also learned a whole new vista of annotation and re-annotation because as we started to add, I think it'll be easier to show you this in the full page. As we started to add these drum parts, we have a, we have a ride cymbal, we have a, a snare and a kick. Um, it ended up to be just a whole lot easier to put eighth note rests everywhere so we can figure out what the percussion is doing compared to the other percussion, you know, like, you know, da da boom. <laughs> That's exactly what it sounds like. Just listen to this, you know. Yeah. So you'll hear the whole thing in a second. So that was fun. So we did our video work. Uh, 
we shot that video that we showed you that we shot it live we just turned on the recorder and boom and saved it and then we we only had to do one fancy thing uh but it uh which is right in here we were doing the window on the on the vr environment and it turned out that um where you well where you tell it to download it works but you can't see where it downloaded so we had to kind of floop it in and floop it out download here Download folder and guess what whoomp there it is so whoomp so we're very proud of that uh, and justifiably so because a year ago we couldn't have done that could not have done that we also did another quick bit of work here where we again we inserted some music from buddha's lilt How do we know that's Buddha's lilt? Because it's from here. We just heard it a minute ago, actually. And then we took the ending music from one of these piano parts. So you've seen us do that before with one of, uh, one of the other video edits. So again, we're, we're really incorporating more of the music and the animation trading off their roles, who's the star, who's the accompanist, and sometimes it's not even the animation is the accompaniment, is the star, it's it's the voice, uh, or whatever. So what we're going to do is play for you the new newest uh, version of part two, which is this one here. It's a little easier to keep track of like that. So here we go. So that concludes today's stream. What we really like about the refactored piece is the notation. This looks so much cleaner here, um, especially in this fast part. Uh, we also continue to be intrigued by how we are learning to annotate this stuff. I mean, theoretically, this could be shown as a you know a half note, da 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 da, but somehow we just it looks more right the way we've got it annotated and if we were playing it we could figure it out it wouldn't hurt and then also we we're really kind of tickled with having added a whole percussion and the bass and the bass the walking it's a walking paste bass you know boom. walking but then we're also doing kind of more uh, syncopated bass here So we're just tickled. So our ideas for next time are, we're gonna post those videos that we were just showing you uh, and continue working on part two and especially the ending. The ending doesn't have any percussion, any bass. Uh, it just, just flies to the end and we're, we're gonna let our muse catch up about what to do with that. Uh, speaking of muse, acknowledges out to Miss Cleo who came by and PDX unheftly. Thank you for coming. We appreciate it. Uh, tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care. Do come back and do keep on streaming.